Welcome to this introductory look at X Generative Design. This application is packaged within the 3D Pattern Shape Creator role on the 3D Experience platform. It's designed to create complex patterns that will be resource intensive or very difficult to manage with traditional CAD tools. This is thanks to cloud computing and a range of tools that we'll explore in this video. When creating a new part in the size range of your choice, you'll see that the graphics view is similar to traditional CAD applications like SOLIDWORKS and has many of the features that you're already familiar with. These include sketch tools like lines and circles and surfacing features like revolve and extrude. Dividing curves and surfaces is a simple command that allows you to take a quicker top-down approach to patterning. These tools are also accessible in the scripting interface, which uses operators and nodes to create design features. The range of commands in this mode is what really gives the application its edge. Creating patterns often involves some type of list, and you can adjust and repurpose these lists to meet your design criteria. Operators can even be broadcasted, so they're easy to access when you need them later in the design process. For greater control over the orientation of curves, surfaces can be used to support them. All of the operators that are added in the scripting interface are also listed in the design tree back in the graphics view. Many of the features can be changed here, whether it's to adjust their values or colors. Function evaluators bring a qualitative aspect to the regular parametric features, allowing you to tweak the spacing between elements without worrying about exact numerical values. Operators can be grouped into folders for visual clarity. It's also a good way to organize a sequence that will be saved as a user operator. These allow you to build up a collection of design patterns that can be used for other geometry later on. Incoming nodes to your selection are tagged as inputs and you can change their name and descriptions. The same is true for the outputs. The user operator can then be saved to a library that others can access. Exgenerative Design is compatible with other design apps on the platform. Let's take this surface that was modeled in XDesign and just drag and drop it into XGen. Toggling on the library that the operator was saved in allows us to see it in the toolbar. We can connect the appropriate nodes and make a few adjustments to create the same type of pattern on this surface as we had on the previous part. The function evaluator can also be tweaked to give a more desirable look for this different curvature profile. With the 3D Pattern Shape Creator role, you can manage complex variations in your most organic design data. 